So typically a predatory lender will only locate in a community where the credit score is 500 or less. And what we're doing in partnership with Justine Peterson and Operation Hope and the St. Louis Office of Financial Empowerment is trying to help citizens increase their credit scores to at least 700 or better because that will steal customers away from predatory lenders. Justine Peterson has been a great partner for economic empowerment and lifting our citizens out of poverty. JP is an interesting place in the in the sense that we really uh, try to pull together the worlds of social work and banking, which isn't usually something we see. Uh, but JP makes that connection probably the best out of anyone in the field. Um, it's about trial and error, oftentimes. But that's the goal: is to really uh, work with others to help them understand how credit works for them. Well, I mean, I don't think I need to be the one to explain um, kind of the pipeline that exists around um, incarceration and the disparities that exist with incarceration and the communities that are impacted by more greatly than others. Um, but I think that in specific to just addressing poverty, when you begin to address asset poverty with people who have been previously incarcerated, it begins to open doors for them, um, you know, uh, in terms of uh, checking off one less barrier as they're searching for consistent employment or just financial and well-being. They have a lot of walls in front of them um, and I think any wall that we can kind of begin to take down brick by brick with them is important. What's unique about Justine Peterson is the fact that we are a service-oriented organization. We're here to assist people who won't necessarily have the funds, who would like to start small businesses, who would like to repair their credit, who are looking to become first-time home buyers. Justine Peterson takes a chance on people and help give them that leg up where they might not be able to get that from a traditional lender. And I thoroughly enjoy what I do and being a part of this organization. Well, I think the culture of JP is really to uh, help the people that come here. Um, people that come to JP have a lot of challenges and um, I think we don't approach the people that come here as numbers or as meeting quotas and we really try and help them succeed and we do things differently because of that because we're not a traditional bank um, and so um, I think that's a big difference between us and you know your bank down the street. Justine Peterson as a strong uh, nonprofit, as a strong uh, community partner it's of critical importance that it has the expertise and the uh, wherewithal to play the role, the expected role of a nonprofit in forming partnerships that are designed to benefit the community. Justine Peterson uh, plays that role um, in a very strong way. One of the things that I really am proud to be a part of is a grassroots effort to assist companies in not only growing themselves and the entrepreneurs that own them, but the other families that work with them uh, as employees and other people that they touch. Uh, Justine Peterson has a motto of building assets, changing lives, and I think that's true to form when it comes to an organization like this. And again, I'm very proud to be a part of that uh, activity.